in her conference on the exponential asymptotic of solutions of the nonlinear Cauchy Riemann Beltrami type equations. She works in Institute of Mathematics of the National Academy of Science of Ukraine. Thank you very much for your presentation. Please go ahead, Maria. Uh, yes, thank you. Uh, uh, Ruslan Salimov is a co-author of this work. Uh, let G uh, be a domain in the complex plane uh, C that is a connected and open subset C and mu from G to the complex plane C be measurable function with model of mu uh, is less than uh, one almost everywhere in G. Uh, the Beltrami equation is, uh, is called the equation of the form one. The function mu is called complex coefficient. Coefficient Beltrami equations were investigated in the works of Alfors, Astala, Bers, Boyarsky, Brakalova, Weil, Vekua, Hutlansky, David, Jenkins, Ivanets, Lechto, Martin, Martio, Miklukov, Vyazanus, Vorbones, Rebro, Suhava, Yakubov. Let uh, C, sigma from uh, G to the complex plane C be measurable function and M is greater than or equal to zero to zero. Consider the following equation in the polar coordinate system R theta of the form two, where F by F by R and uh, F by, te by theta are partial derivatives of the mapping F with respect to R and theta accordingly. Given the formula three, the equation two can be written in a complex form uh, four. If M is equal is equal to zero, uh, if M equals to zero, then the equation four is reduced to the ordinary Beltrami equation one with a complex co coefficient of the form five. If in, uh, in uh, four, m is equal to zero and sigma is equal to uh, equals to minus uh, i divided by modulo of z then we get the cauchy riemann system everywhere further uh, we will consider that m is uh, greater than zero the mapping f uh, from g to the complex plane c is called uh, regular in at the point uh, z zero from uh, G, if at uh, this point F has a complete differential and, at it, and its Jacobian uh, GF uh, does not equal to zero. The, the homeomorphism of F of the Sobolev class uh, W11 log is called, called regular if F, GF uh, is greater than zero almost everywhere. We call uh, a regular homeomorphic solution of the equation for the regular homeomorphism f uh, from G to the complex plane C that satisfies the equation for almost everywhere. Everywhere further, we will consider that Br is an uh, open disk uh, uh, of uh, the radius r. Uh, centered at the, the origin. B uh, is uh, the open disk uh, with the radius uh, unit uh, centered with the origin. And the hammer, air, hammer air is the circle of the radius R centered at the origin. And uh, R0, R1, R2 is uh, the ring with the radii R1 and R2. Uh, consider logarithmic, logarithmic asymptotic of the solutions of the Beltrami equation. Theorem one: Let m is greater is greater than zero. F uh, from B to the complex plane C be a regular homeomorphic solution of the equation form of the Sobolev class W one to log with zero normalization. F of zero is equals to zero. And uh, this integral does not equal to infinity. Uh, for almost uh, 
all t uh, from the interval from uh, zero to uh, unit. Suppose that the, for some numbers, c uh, is greater than zero, alpha is greater than or equals to zero, and less than or equals to m plus two divided by m plus one and epsilon zero from uh, interval uh, from uh, zero to unit, uh, the following condition six is fulfilled for, uh, for any uh, epsilon from the interval uh, from uh, zero to epsilon zero. Then uh, the asymptotic uh, estimate seven is fulfilled. Uh, consider a following example uh, to this theorem. Suppose that M uh, belongs to the interval from uh, 0 to 2. Consider the equation 8 in the unit disk B. We show uh, that the mapping F uh, belongs to the space 1, 2 log uh, of B. Uh, really, F is a, a homeomorphism of the class uh, uh, C1 uh, in uh, B uh, minus zero. Hence, in particular, it follows that F uh, belongs to the space uh, W12 uh, log of B minus zero, but uh, B R0 uh, with a bar over it uh, is uh, uh, the closed disk uh, of the radius as R0. Uh, centered with uh, the origin, uh, where R0 uh, belongs to the interval uh, from zero to unit. We find partial derivatives of the mapping F, R by R and F, F, F by R and F by theta. And um, we find uh, integrals of the form uh, nine. Uh, obviously, uh, both integrals con convergent if uh, m uh, belongs to the interval from uh, 0 to 2. Uh, let's check that the mapping f uh, is the solution of the equation 8. Indeed, we have following equality 10. Uh, next, we find imaginary part of sigma with a bar over it. Uh, let's check that the condition six of the theorem one is fulfilled. Really, if uh, alpha equals to unit, uh, uh, we have uh, following uh, inequality. On the other hand, it is easy to see that uh, that next limit at uh, uh, that uh, goes to zero is equal to one to unit. Uh, uh, corollary one, let M is greater than zero, uh, B from uh, B to the complex plane C, be a regular homeomorphic solution of the equation four of the Sobolev plus W12 log with the normalization F of zero is equal to zero. And imaginary, imaginary part uh, of uh, sigma with a bar over it is greater than or uh, equals to lambda of r for almost uh, all r from the interval uh, from uh, zero to epsilon zero, uh, where epsilon zero belongs to the interval from uh, zero to one, where lambda r is uh, is positive infinite uh, almost everywhere on the interval from zero to epsilon zero uh, measurable function. Suppose that for some numbers, k uh, uh, that is greater than zero, alpha is greater than uh, is or um, equals to zero and less uh, than or equals to uh, m plus uh, two divided by m plus one for and for any epsilon from the interval uh, from zero to epsilon zero, the following condition 11 is uh, fulfilled. Then the, the, follow, uh, the uh, asymptotic estimate uh, uh, 12 is, uh, is fulfilled.
uh, below is the asymptotic behavior of, the, of regular solutions of the Beltrami equation for in terms of uh, an iter iterative uh, scale, uh, sky, scale of log logarithms. In the further, we will denote uh, year uh, one is e equals to uh, year, year two equals to year uh, to power of year, and uh, year k plus one equals to year to power of year k. And uh, logarithm one, uh, natural logarithm one uh, of t equals to natural logarithm t. Natural logarithm uh, two of t is uh, equals to natural logarithm of natural natural logarithm t, and uh, uh, logarithm k plus one of t equals to natural logarithm of uh, log logarithm k uh, of t, where k is greater than or equals to unit are natural numbers. Uh, theorem two, let m is greater than zero. F from v to the complex plane C be a regular homeomorphic solution of the equation four of the Sobolev class W12 log with the normalization f of zero is equals to zero. And this integral uh, does uh, uh, not equal to infinity uh, for almost all uh, t uh, from the interval from uh, zero to uh, year n uh, to the power of minus one. Suppose that the sum number C uh, that uh, is greater than zero, alpha that is greater uh, than or equals to zero and less than or equals to m plus uh, two uh, divided by m plus one and epsilon zero from the interval from zero to the n uh, to power of uh, minus one, the following condition 13 is fulfilled for is fulfilled for any epsilon from the interval uh, from zero to epsilon zero. Then uh, the the estimate uh, the asymptotic estimate uh, 14 is fulfilled. Uh, Parting in the theorem uh, two and uh, that uh, equals uh, to unit, we get the the following statement. Corollary two, uh, let M uh, is greater than zero. F from B to the complex plane C be a regular homeomorphic solution of the equation four of the Sobolev class W12 log with the normalization F of zero is equal to zero. And um, uh, this integral does not uh, equal uh, to infinity for almost uh, all T from the interval from zero to year to the power of minus one, suppose that for some numbers, uh, CZ is greater than zero and this alpha and this epsilon zero, the following condition 15 is fulfilled for any epsilon from this interval from zero to epsilon zero, that uh, uh, the asymptotic estimate uh, 16 is fulfilled. Uh, cor corollary three, uh, let M is greater than zero, uh, B from zero to the complex plane C be a regular homeomorphic solution of the equation form of the Sobolev class W12 log with the normalization f of zero is equal to zero and imaginary part of sigma with a bar over a bar over it is greater than or equals to lambda of r for almost all r uh, from interval uh, for uh, from uh, zero to epsilon zero uh, for this epsilon uh, zero uh, from interval uh, from zero to the uh, to power to the power of minus zero, where lambda r is positive and finite almost everywhere on uh, 
uh, at uh, on the interval from zero to epsilon zero measurable function. Suppose that for some numbers, uh, kappa is greater than zero, uh, this uh, alpha, and for any epsilon from interval from uh, zero to epsilon zero, zero, the following equation condition uh, 17 is fulfilled. Then the asymptotic estimate uh, 18 is fulfilled. Uh, corollary four, that M is greater than zero B from B to the complex, F uh, from B to the complex plane C be a regular homeomorphic solution of the equation four of the Sobolev plus W12 log with the normalization F of zero is greater, e is uh, uh, equals to zero. And imaginary part of uh, sigma with a bar over it is greater than or equals to lambda r for, for almost all, all uh, r uh, from the interval from zero to epsilon zero, uh, where epsilon zero belongs to the interval from zero to year uh, to the power of minus one, where lambda r is positive and finite almost everywhere on uh, interval from zero to epsilon zero measurable function. Suppose that for some numbers, k is greater than zero, as is alpha, and for any epsilon from interval from zero to epsilon zero, the following condition uh, 19 is fulfilled. Uh, then the, the asymptotic uh, estimate 20 is fulfilled. Uh, consider exponential as asymptotic of solutions of the Beltrami equation, theorem three. Uh, let M is greater than zero, F from B to the complex plane C be a regular homeomorphic solution of the equation four of the Sobolev plus W12 log with the normalization uh, F of zero equals to zero. And this integral uh, does not equal uh, to infinity for almost all uh, T, from interval from uh, zero to unit. Suppose so, that for some numbers, uh, C is greater than zero, P is greater than zero, and this alpha and epsilon from interval from zero to unit, the following condition 21 is fulfilled for any epsilon from interval uh, from zero to epsilon zero. Then uh, the asymptotic, Estimate 22 is fulfilled. Uh, we consider the following example. Suppose that alpha is greater than zero. Consider the equation 23 in the unit disk B. We show that the mapping F belongs to the space W12 log of B. Really, F is a homeomorphism of the class C1 in B. Um, uh, minus one. Uh, hence, in particular, it follows that F belongs to the space W12 log uh, of B minus zero. Uh, part uh, uh, B R zero with a bar, bar over it is uh, the closed uh, disk uh, of the radius as R zero centered. Um, to the origin, to the origin uh, where R0 uh, belongs to the interval from zero to unit. We find partial derivatives of map, the mapping, mapping F, F by R and F by theta. And uh, uh, we find uh, uh, these uh, integrals 24. Obviously, both integrals convergent if alpha uh, is greater than zero. Let's check that the mapping F is the solution of the equation 23. Indeed, we have the following equality 25. Uh, next, we find imaginary part of uh, sigma with uh, a, bar or, a bar over it. Let's check that the uh, condition 21 of the theorem 3 is fulfilled. Really, if alpha equals to unit, uh, we have following uh, inequality. 
uh, on the other hand, it, it is easy to see that uh, uh, the limit uh, 26 uh, equals to unit at that goes to zero. But in, in theorem three, alpha um, is uh, alpha uh, equals to zero. We get the following statement: corollary four, five. Let m is greater than zero. F from B to the complex plane C be a regular homeomorphic solution of the equation four of the Sobolev class W12 uh, log with the normalization F zero is greater than zero. And this integral does not equal to infinity for almost all P from interval from uh, zero to unit. Suppose that for some number C, is greater than zero, p is greater than zero, and epsilon uh, that belongs to the interval from zero to unit, the following condition 27 is fulfilled. Then the asymptotic estimate 28 is fulfilled. Uh, corollary six, uh, let m is greater than zero, b from b, f from b to the complex plane c be a regular homeomorphic solution of the the equation four of the Sobolev class W12 log with the normalization f of zero is greater than zero. And imaginary part of uh, sigma with a bar over it is greater than or equals to lambda r for almost or all r uh, that belongs to the interval from zero to epsilon zero, where epsilon zero belongs to the interval from zero to unit, where lambda r is uh, positive and finite almost everywhere on zero to epsilon zero measurable function. Suppose for some numbers, uh, k is greater than zero, this alpha, and for n epsilon from interval from zero to epsilon zero, the following condition uh, 29 is fulfilled. Then the, the asymptotic estimate uh, 13, 30 is uh, fulfilled, 30 is fulfilled. But in, in corollary, corollary uh, six alpha equals to zero, we get the, the following statement. Corollary seven, uh, let M is greater than zero, uh, F from B to the complex plane C be a regular homeomorphic solution of the equation form of the Sobolev class one two log with the normalization f of zero is the greater uh, uh, f of zero equals to zero and imaginary part of uh, sigma with a bar over it is greater than or equals to lambda of r for almost or r uh, that belongs to the interval from zero to epsilon zero where epsilon zero belongs to the interval from uh, zero to unit where lambda r is positive at finite and finite almost everywhere on uh, interval from zero to epsilon zero measurable function. Suppose for some number k is greater than zero, the following condition thir 31 is fulfilled. Then the uh, asymptotic estimate 22, uh, 32 uh, is fulfilled. Uh, this uh, results published uh, published uh, in uh, the journal Nonlinear Oscillations. Oscillations. Uh, thank you for your attention. So <clears throat> we are very grateful with your uh, speak, your talk. Please, uh, there are some questions about of these estimations. I have one. Yes, yeah, yeah. Uh, Darius Partica wants to uh, to ask some question. Please, Maria. Could you please stand down your hand? Okay. I, I, have, I have a question. Yes. You estimate uh, limbus inferior, so uh, from 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 up. 
Excuse me. One moment. I need to. to... So excuse me for some sound problems. I, I, I repeat my question. You estimated the uh, limiting behavior at zero for uh, from uh, lim uh, limits inferior from up. Is it possible to as uh, to make that? Oh yeah, yes, like uh, thirty two. Uh, so in, in, it, it seems to me that it would be better to estimate a limit superior from up. Uh, is it a real problem to, to estimate limit superior from up? So in other words, is it possible to replace limit uh, inferior by uh, Limits superior in uh, your results, perhaps not exactly of the same form, but is it possible to uh, to estimate limits superior from up? Um, so it is possible to find upper bound for limits superior. Perhaps it's a difficult problem, I, I don't know. But for me, it would be more, uh, more uh, uh, natural to, to estimate limits superior from R. Okay. Can you hear me? Uh, yes. Uh, yes. Uh, I I think uh, they uh, did not think about this. Oh. Okay, I understand. Uh, Professor Partik, I think if it is possible to obtain uh, such an estimation that uh, they will be uh, obtained. So it, it is uh, uh, maybe it is uh, uh, essential problem. I, I think they make uh, uh, such estimations that is possible. Okay. Thank you. Thank you very much for your answer.